Early Evolution Be a doll now, you say, and I am become one. I pluck a flock raw for its plumage. Strip, I say, and birds strip bare. I stuff myself so full with their stuffing. I bulge with all their lorem ipsum. Poke me, and I spill sawdust from feather guts. I fear everything that could happen to this form. The worst would be if you didn't notice my hunger. I could dance the seven veils to thrive you. I could drive stakes into highway medians to campaign for your attention. I would have the edge of an underdog, underfed and unassuming. Is it beauty when it baffles you? With the right filter, I am half pretty, but mostly very ugly from my habitat. Rank me on a super smooth bell curve. Numbers evade me, so give me images. Be a doll now and bring me my silver charger, loaded with one star ruby and an antique melon baller. Self-pity is the soul of my wit, you say, but I'm working to extinguish that urge. I burn lovely hairs at my bedside. I steal fresh palms from my neighbors and swirl these together in a saucepan to keep pests from coming in. Shapewear. A body is matter to be molded by use of whalebone and lace, or by taking a body for long walks. There are ways to file one down, to make a body a better shape, not this boring shrub fruit. Try an hourglass if you want to remind a man of his mortality. Best to become a clock. The sands of time will get up inside you each time you are picked up and turned over. You will always be itching. Never mind the home remedies. Some men like to have a project to hammer away at. Did you know some women are shaped like bananas? I have never seen one myself in the wild, only as figure three in a state-approved textbook, because they teach this stuff in health class to lead girls into their own dysmorphia. You are what you eat, so from now on, I am surviving on spunk. I want to possess whatever allows you to be bold without getting called feisty. My gut reaction when I am in the world is to apologize whether or not I am sorry. No one's ever said sorry to me for making my eyelashes stick together with their egg on my face. I am doll eyes. I need a doll waist. I make a lovely figure with what I've been given when I encase my body in exoskeleton. This is how I want to be looked at but not seen. Who decides what the body absorbs? versus what it reflects, and how are our bodies not the most boring thing about us by now? I would starve mine to transcend or shuffle off if I knew you wouldn't find it cute. I would stand naked at the altar in the name of the patriarchy, in the name of its sons, in the name of the spirit of capitalism. When can we retire the syllogism Time is money, is the root of evil. We all know that women are the root, and the dirt, and the stem, and the bulb. We are ripe, swelling fruits, carrying the seeds of our mutually assured destruction. The ways in which we fuck each other up, let me count them. They are endless, fluffy sheep, bedding me for beauty rest. Divide the hoof. What hurts today is the evidence of effort. I brushed my teeth and lined my eyes. 
came back to bed to feel mistaken. Some days I am more synthetic than others. I have many moods, they turn in systems. I am in the habit of my own diagonals, but I get that the patterns are medley. I like how even when the sky is ugly, it's not. Some days I make myself a fatted calf, chewing cud for your arrival. How pleased am I to have you, even as you show me the rumper, the splitter, the vat dipper. If I imagine these things are paper and gloss, I can get off on my own lack. My moods are many animals. We're all lined up at the stockyard, waiting our turns. Someday, I'd like to be one prime cut of my choicest offering. When you eat an animal, are you absorbing its life or its death? I'm not sure it makes a difference. Dominion Theory God loved the world, so he peopled it. God got hungry, so he grabbed a rib and some barbecue sauce. God got horny, so he cooked the rib into a woman. This is how we are made. We are made in sudden fever, just in time for rutting season, which is also hunting season, which is how a Bambi happens. Little orphan Bambi, you must learn to be buoyant. You must learn to dodge bullets in balletic ascension. We would water cracked leaves to quiet floors for you. Our estrogens are always putting us out on limbs like this. How small can you make your caring? Can you care for the tick on your flank? Bambi, this is why we love you.